Hello, my name is Brian. In this video, we're going to see how you can check and see the password you're using for your Gmail. You may have forgot it or it's already saved, but you want to know the password you're using, okay? So without test wasting time, this I'm on a browser called Mozilla. So I'm going to first show you how you can do it on Mozilla. So what you do is you have to go to your browser menu. If you don't have a browser menu, okay, if it's not showing, you can do Alt F. Okay, it usually pops up this top menu on your browser if you don't see it. Okay, so when I go to my browser me uh, tools menu, I have to go to okay, we have file edit, you have to go to tools. When you go to tools, you go to settings. When you go to settings, go to privacy and security. If you're on privacy and security, you go to saved passwords. When you on save passwords, you browse through the sites that you have. If you want to recover the, see the Gmail password, you go to your, the Gmail, okay? So Gmail is under accounts with Google. So you're trying to find the password I've used for Andy Isaac. I have a lot of emails, so I have to take time to find it, okay? If it's uh, giving you a lot of time, you can just type here, check passwords, Andy Isaac, okay? can easily bring me what I'm looking for. So I'm looking for this. I'll click on it. Then this section will come. Then I have to just click on the I. So, okay, to realize I'm using Pretoria 2020. Of course, of course I've changed this password now since I'm, I'm doing a video, so don't bother hacking me. So yeah, that's how you see that password. You can actually copy it. You can even edit it or you can even remove it, okay? So let's try to, see how you can do it on Chrome, okay? Let me go back, let me switch to Chrome. And uh, so let me assume like I have a, it's the same email, uh, uh, like the password works, but I can't, uh, I can't know um, uh, the password. Let me say like, maybe you, you change the browser and you can't remember the password that you use because yeah, you can easily say show password, it's fine, but the time you can't remember the, the the Gmail, the password you use for Gmail, okay? Maybe you change the device or something, okay? So, or you're no longer using your PC. So what you do, you go to uh, these three dots on the top right, because Chrome is a bit different from Mozilla. They usually don't have that browser menu on the top. So you have to go to the, to the top right where you see those three dots, okay? Or you can just place on your keyboard Alt F at the same time, okay? If that is hard, you can go to the top right, click on these three dots, go to passwords and autofill, then go to Google Password Manager. When you click on Google Password Manager, you're going to bring uh, all the sites that you have on your browser. So these passwords have to be have to have been saved, okay? If you have never saved anything on your computer, of course the passwords won't be there, okay? So I'm trying to recover for Gmail. You realize I even have for Facebook. So if I want to cover for Facebook, I can go here. Google, I have to here. Twitter, I have to go here. So I want for Gmail, so I'll click here. When I click here, Gmail, sorry, Chrome has a security precaution. It usually tells you to enter the password for your computer. Such that if someone is found your computer and is trying to fetch these passwords, he will be stuck because he doesn't know the password for your computer. So let me put in the password for my computer. Okay. Wow, I think it's wrong. Let me try another one. Okay, it's right. Okay. See, it will show me like the username is this and the password I'm using is CI. So I can easily say show password. So it can show me the password I use for my Gmail. So that's how you can find the password you're using for your Gmail in case you are stuck in how you can find it, okay? So this method can show you all the passwords for other websites, by the way. It's the same procedure if you want to see the password maybe for your Facebook, you just go to password autofill, then you go to your Facebook, then, you know, something like that. You do the same as we have done, something like that, okay? So, yep, so that's how you can view the password for your Gmail. Thank you for watching and appreciate the subscription. Bye-bye.